Have you ever stopped to ponder the origins of the very ground beneath your feet or the walls that surround you? Many might be surprised to learn that concrete, the unassuming, ubiquitous material that forms the foundation of our modern world, isn't a recent invention but has been with us for thousands of years. Our journey begins in the ancient world, around 6,000 years ago. The first recorded use of concrete-like materials dates back to the era of the Nabatea traders or Bedouins who occupied and controlled a series of oases and developed a small empire in the regions of southern Syria and northern Jordan in around 6000 BCE. They discovered that by mixing volcanic ash with lime and water, they could produce a material that had similar properties to what we now recognize as concrete. Fast forward to the Roman Empire, where concrete took a significant leap forward. The Romans mixed lime and volcanic rock to create a strong and durable material. This Roman concrete was used to build structures that are still standing today, like the Colosseum and the Pantheon. The secret to their success was the inclusion of volcanic ash, which when mixed with lime and seawater, produced a chemical reaction that significantly increased the strength of the concrete. However, with the fall of the Roman Empire around the 5th century, the knowledge and techniques of concrete were lost for over a thousand years. It wasn't until the mid-18th century that concrete re-emerged in the modern world. A British engineer named John Smeaton discovered that by mixing powdered limestone and clay, then burning them and grinding the result into a powder, he could create a version of modern cement, which when mixed with sand and aggregates, produced a robust and durable concrete. In the mid-19th century a Frenchman named Louis Vica further refined the process, and in 1824, Joseph Aspton, an English bricklayer, patented Portland cement, which remains the dominant form of cement in use today. The 20th century saw further advancements. Reinforced concrete, which incorporates steel bars for added strength, was developed, and pre-stressed concrete, which compresses the material to increase its resistance to stress, was introduced. Today, concrete is everywhere, forming the backbone of our cities and infrastructure. It's used in everything from skyscrapers to bridges, roads to dams. It's an unsung hero of the modern world, a testament to human ingenuity and our ability to shape the world around us. In summary, the journey of concrete is a fascinating one. From its roots in the ancient world with the Nabataea traders, its widespread use in Roman times, its re-emergence in the 18th century, to its dominance in the modern world, concrete has been a constant companion in our journey as a civilization. It's a story of discovery, loss, rediscovery, and constant innovation. And as we stand on this solid foundation we can only wonder, where will it take us next?